Welcome back to Reaction Zero. I am Tyrell, and we are back playing Seven Days to Die. I'll be providing more helpful tips and tricks to apply to your game. When managing your hunger and thirsty meters, always eat first, then drink, because eating healthy foods to improve your wellness dehydrates you. A good tip for new players, when collecting empty cans at the start, don't throw them away. You can collect murky water in them, boil them at the campfire for clean drinking water without the need of a cooking pot. To get more skills for your skill tree, complete challenges found on paper by other survivors. You can start multiple challenges at the same time. If you want to pick up multiple items off the floor at the same time, hold down the action button. On the PS4 it'll be triangle. If you have a desert biome available and a gas can schematic, then you can level science from 0 to 100 very quickly by crafting gas on the campfire. To craft gas, you'll need oil shell found in the desert biome by mining. The stone will have a purple hue to it and is somewhat shiny. The desert biome will be the tan color on your map. Always aim for the head of zombies, as it does massive damage and will save you ammo for guns and stamina when using blunt weapons. A pro tip is to not use your skills you have obtained on skills that you can gain by playing the game. Use your skills on items that cost you 5 to 10 points at a time. This way, you're not wasting a potential experience and skill points. This will be helpful later on in the game. In order for new loot to respawn in objects, there must be no old loot inside. Remove all old loot if you wish to loot here again in the future. An annoying audio bug will occur when driving your bike causing the audio to disappear. To regain the audio, release the gas button for your bike and the sound will return. If you can't wait for loot or zombies to respawn, mod the options for loot to respawn every 5 days and set the day night cycle to 10 minutes. It's wise to also disable zombies for this method. Relax at your base for 50 minutes and everything should respawn. Just place all options back to your preferred spots and have fun. When max crafting miscellaneous items such as clothes, always max craft items that require the most materials because you will level much faster and requiring less of a grind. Just like the calipers, the tool and die set required to unlock the full potential of your forge will be located at the working stiff shop. The tool and die set will allow you to craft rocket casings and rocket tips. If you're new and enjoyed this content, please drop a like, comment what you'd like to see next, and subscribe. Thanks for watching, and keep this reaction time set to zero. Peace!